Hi, I'm Garrett Bulkus with Last Bread TV. And on this episode of Image Autopsy, we're gonna look at a beautiful dark horn 10 pointer called Slick. Slick was one of the bucks that frequented our farm several years ago. And understanding when the right time to hunt him was key to lead to his harvest. The farm we hunted was 110 acres and comprised about 50% tillable, 50% timber. We typically would run eight to 10 cameras to cover our needs. Slick was a buck that we put on the hit list in early October, but we didn't have any daylight pictures of him yet. However, in November, he began to work very close to daylight. When we moved in a little closer, we used cameras that had infrared flash and really good PIR sensitivity. We wanted to make sure to pick him up when he was moving in there. We set our cameras along heavy trails and a big bottom where we knew Slick was working. One of the trail cameras we had was very close to one of our stand locations. We would make sure to go in there only to pull cards either when we hunted or when the conditions were right, after a rainstorm or just before a rain. The last card pull that we had before we had an opportunity to harvest Slick, he daylighted two days in a row on that camera. The following set of days, we pushed in deep and we hunted hard. We knew that that stand in that bottom Slick was using and using it during daylight. And all in all, we used cameras to understand when the right time to go in and hunt was. Without knowing that Slick was daylighting frequently in that bottom, we may have hunted in another location. But given the data that we'd gotten from our card pull a couple days before, made sure that we were in the stand when he walked by. We're back in the saddle, November 4th. Misty overcast day, had a phenomenal encounter this morning. 40 yards right there. I love you, man. I love you. Dude, that's his, that is slick. That worked perfect. I looked over, I was like, shoot, or giant. That's how it's supposed to work. That's how it's fine. Right there. I was hoping to shoot him in this hole. Oh boy, I hope he's got a shot. 323 rattled and killed. A giant buck. I pretty sure 99% sure that is a deer we call slick. Had him all over the south end of our farm. Had him down here a couple times. We're gonna go get him. Here's the thing. Do we keep hunting or do we grab him and get out of here? It's November the 4th. It's white hot. Either way we're gonna go get our hands on it right now. beautiful deer this is a deer we named slick a great great 10 pointer huge fours great twos and threes huge neck mature deer grunted rattled brought him right in on a string i shot him at about 13 yards he actually worked the scraped rubbed some trees and he marched right down 